Today we are back with another very interesting video on this channel, okay? Now yesterday we reacted to a video where an OnlyFans mother was getting her back blown out while her son was calling for her name. <laughs> now to me, that's a complete misallocation of energy when it comes to your priorities. You have to understand that you're a mother first, alright? We have a very interesting video today. Girl bashes her baby on Facebook Live and calls him ugly and funny looking. Now that is crazy. I told you on yesterday's video that there are just some people who are just not mentally equipped to be parents, bro. Fuck the money part. They're just not mentally stable enough to bring and raise a kid into this world. I know this video right here is kind of old. I only seen clips of it. I never seen the full video. So we're going to watch the full video today. All right. Make sure I do leave a like down below and subscribe to the channel. Road to one milli. But let's get into it, man. But his funny looking self, he oh. got all the hurt. We starting off like that. I ain't wanna have no ugly baby. I just knew that it was gonna be a 50-50 chance that one of these kids was gonna come out ugly. Cause of him. Now look. Now I gotta wait for his looks and shit to come in. One minute he look all handsome, and the other minute he look like fucking alien versus predator. He need to pick a sign, he need to pick it quick. <laughs> That's crazy. That's, I'm not laughing. The situation is not funny. But that's crazy for her to say. That was crazy. This your baby? Oh, bless his heart. Yeah, I know what that shit mean. I'm sorry. Your daddy marked you. You look like him. You ugly. You're, you're ugly. What are you talking about? You're grown and ugly. <laughs> that's cool, though. What are you talking about? We're just sitting in the front seat thugging. At the water park, watching his sister's man play, and she up her too. We in air conditioning. Okay. How many kids they got up in that car? My damn, yeah, too many kids. Girl, it's true, man. It's true. It's okay. He ain't gonna be ugly all his life. At least I hope not. Woo, Father God, in the name of Jesus, let him grow up to be handsome. Cause right now I'm just he he not feeling it. You see how wrong this is or not? Am I tripping? He looks just like you. Why? You yeah. gonna get your ass blocked. He don't look shit like me. I'm not gonna lie. She look like a rat. I'm not ugly. Yes, you and are. And I'm putting an ugly baby. Yes, you are. Trust me. He's Trust funny me. looking. I don't want to call him ugly. I'm gonna just call him funny looking. That's crazy. Look bro. at him. Oh my God. Your daddy need a whooping. He need his ass. Let me call your daddy. Bro, like, this shit is so sad. People don't understand what they're, like, people don't understand their actions. And when I tell you guys to work on yourself, a lot of people take it as a joke. When I mean work on yourself, I mean awareness is a part of working on yourself. This woman has absolutely no awareness for the things that she's saying. Like, her words are very powerful, and they're going to affect this child one day. Whether the kid grows up to be two, three, four years old and she feels this way, she's going to say it to the child, yo, you're ugly because you're daddy. Bro, how do you think that's going to, the kid is going to grow up having absolutely no confidence in himself. He's going to grow up thinking that he's genuinely ugly. Like, to me, that's just tough. To me, that they're, every single parent should always be uplifting to their child, empowering to their child, not fucking degrading, calling him ugly on Insta on Twitter. Facebook live so you can laugh at like like who does this shit like who would like this makes me genuinely feel bad for people bro Like genuinely feel bad. I feel bad For the baby because he's gonna grow up to have a mother like this and I feel bad for the mother because she wasn't she wasn't taught any better She wasn't taught About being aware of this thing that she's saying and, and the power in her words, bro. She wasn't taught these things So I feel bad Honestly, we about to call your daddy because this right here, this shit don't make no sense. This entire video is negative. She's complaining about her baby, and now she's gonna call her daddy and complain to his baby daddy, ruin his day. Like, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. You, this is you should all have negative. Why the fuck do my son look so funny looking? He he, funny looking. You ain't right. You ain't, what the fuck? You ain't right. Bro. I'm sorry. 
my son look like you, and he just not all that cute she right now. She thinks she funny and shit. <laughs> oh, he just threw up on me. That's karma. <laughs> you get you bot looking at Mitch ugly rat looking forehead as Mitch you fucking roach looking at Mitch <laughs> let me not go to her level let me stay elevated <laughs> let me stay elevated let me not get to her level you know what I'm saying it's all in between my legs it's good for you bye It's messed up. Girl, uh, we finna go. You either gonna play in that damn water. Get out of my car. Wait number six. Your daddy don't even care. I just called you funny looking. He, and he didn't even say that. All he said was, what you mean he funny looking? Bitch, he ugly. He look like you. We gonna have to fix that. I don't like this, bro. <laughs> I love you, though. Get out my car, go play in the damn water. Get out my car. Bro, it's just like certain people really shouldn't be parents, bro. That's one thing that I can honestly say that I've been, I'm grateful for, bro. Honestly speaking, this is why you have to be grateful for your parents. Because I was blessed enough to have parents who knew how to raise a child together. They put all their past drama aside. They put all whatever discrepancies they had personally, internally, or with each other, whatever it was, they put all of it to the side and made sure that the environment that my brother and I were growing up in was the best environment for children to grow up in. They made sure we went to a good school. They made sure that we were taught valuable lessons. They made sure that we were exposed to certain things on what not to do and what to do. And I really do appreciate them for that. You get what I'm saying? This is exactly why you have to sit down and you have to thank your parents. You have to stop, stop speaking disrespectfully to them. I don't understand why kids nowadays find it so it's so common to just violate your parents and be disrespectful towards your parents. They literally birth you, they literally feed you, clothe you. You know what I'm saying? Like they provide life for you. Appreciate your parents, man. Honestly speaking, because there are parents like this out in the world that I don't know what they were taught, I don't know how they were raised, and I don't I don't know whether or not they are aware of what they say, but this type of shit affects the youth. This type of stuff affects how a kid is raised. And you know what I'm saying? It's just it's just bad to see, man. But look, I'm going to end this video right here. If you guys did enjoy, make sure you do leave a like down below and subscribe. And I'm going to catch you on the next one, man. Peace.